In this video, we will be looking at the topic of oxidation numbers again. Specifically, we're going to be talking about how we can determine the oxidation states for elements which are part of polyatomic ions. Let's first look at the example of bicarbonate. Uh, bicarbonate is a polyatomic ion which contains hydrogen, carbon, and uh, oxygen atoms. Now, some things that we need to know. Oxygen is always going to have a minus 2 oxidation state. So in this example, uh, that's our starting point. So as we consider the formula, HCO3, this is the bicarbonate ion. Now let's remember this has a minus 1 charge overall. We know that we have uh, three oxygen atoms. They all have a minus 2 charge. So this means from oxygen, we have a total negative charge of 6. Now, because hydrogen is written at the front here, we know that the hydrogen has a plus 1 charge. If hydrogen is written first, you know it has a plus 1 charge. So we have 1 hydrogen, positive 1, so we have a total of positive 1. Right now, so far, we've got minus 5. The carbon needs to cancel out most of the negative charge of the oxygen, but we still need to leave a charge of minus 1. So if the carbon has a charge, and there's one carbon, of positive 4, we can add the minus 5 plus 4 to get the net charge of minus 1. So the oxidation states in bicarbonate will be hydrogen is plus 1, carbon is plus 4, and each oxygen is minus 2. Let's take a look at one more example. Let's discuss the polyatomic ion called dichromate. So we want to figure out what is the oxidation state of the uh, chromium. Oxygen, remember, are always going to be negative 2. So let's consider this formula. We know that we have 7 oxygens each with a charge of minus 2. So this totals minus 14. To get the overall charge of minus 2, I know that the chromiums must have a total of plus 12. Minus 14 plus 12 would give me the overall net charge of minus 2 for the polyatomic ion. And I know that I have two of these. So by dividing positive 12 by 2, I get a result of plus 6. Sorry about that, Bell. So by dividing the charge from the chromiums, plus 12, by 2, we can find a charge of positive 6 for each chromium. So the oxidation state for chromium in the polyatomic ion dichromate would be positive 6.